A teeth whitening debate heads to the Supreme Court. What oral health professionals need to know about tomorrow. Chocolate chews for healthy teeth and a solution to reduce waste in the dental office. I'm Allie Cook for the Dental News Network. It is March 19th, 2014 and this is your Wednesday Watch. Here is today's dental news. The topic of teeth whitening is heading to the Supreme Court. The North Carolina Dental Regulatory Board stated last year that only dentists should be allowed to whiten teeth. Now the State Board of Dental Examiners is challenging a lower court ruling and an order by the Federal Trade Commission that said the board engaged in unfair competition by shutting down businesses such as day spas and tanning salons that offered teeth whitening services. The board sued the FTC in 2011, saying the agency overstepped its authority. But the Federal Appeals Court in Virginia sided with the FTC, with one judge saying that the board would have had a stronger case if its members were elected or appointed by state government officials rather than by other dentists. The case will go to the Supreme Court this fall. Tomorrow is World Oral Health Day. This initiative was started by the World Dental Federation in an effort to promote worldwide awareness of oral health and hygiene. Nearly 50 national dental associations have given their support and more than 75 countries are expected to participate in the celebration. Events range from free checkups to flash mobs. Coming up, how one dental manufacturer is taking steps to eliminate waste and more. Exacta Dental Direct will begin packaging smaller mixing tips with its dental materials in an effort to eliminate material waste. These new tips can eliminate up to 30% of wasted material compared with larger tips. Exacta Temp Extra will be the first product to be packaged with the smaller tips, and Exacta's impression materials will follow. Basic Bites are sugar-free chocolate soft chews that help your patients maintain healthy teeth. Basic Bites work with Alcagen technology developed at Stony Brook University. The chews coat the user's teeth with a patented blend of vital nutrients that have been discovered in healthy saliva. More information about both of today's innovative products can be found in the new products section of the March issue of Dentistry Today. Thanks for checking out the Wednesday Watch. We'll see you next week with more from Dentistry Today and DNN.